I've always tried to um, find an innovative solution to a problem. And I think as a result of that, a lot of my buildings are very, very at variance with each other. There's no sort of constant uh, theme amongst them. I would like to think that the, the buildings would be considered always with my prime concern for the emotional content of the building. That's been a constant theme of my own, even though I can't always show it externally in buildings. the Karlstrom House. Unorthodox, unconventional, but an impressive structural solution that competes for the role of classic because of its timeless simplicity. This is home for Craig Karlstrom and his family, as well as a photographic studio. Karlstrom was also the builder. Craig Karlstrom explains the qualities of the design. We have a view from virtually every window because we're down in this reserve and we've got a lot of height so we can really just see wherever we want to see. Um, we're not looking at neighbours' walls and we're just seeing natural bush. I've really enjoyed living here because I really enjoy the amount of light that comes in the place. I, I find if I go to other people's houses now I'm so used to this sunshine pouring in that uh, everywhere else seems really claustrophobic and uh, uh, you know like an old English sort of house and uh, here it's uh, I've just got used to the dazzle, if you like, of, uh, uh, of this sunshine. The design is semicircular or horseshoe shaped and maximizes views over the adjacent reserve. There are three distinct platforms braced by a steel chassis. The top floor is the studio, while the bottom two are for family living. Natural light, nature and function combine to produce a design which delights through its individuality. The evolution of Australian housing has seen a growing recognition of landscape, while the function of natural light, once almost shunned, has become a sharper focus for our best designers and builders. Architect Furio Valic describes the relationship of the structure to the landform. The feature of the finished project I, I see as being a very um, tailored, well-fitting structure on a, on a very difficult site that totally allows the site to live its own life. And the house similarly lives its own life, hence the use of the steel, steel posts giving minimal interruption to the ground. I see the design of the house as being a pragmatic solution to various problems, hence it's probably more a piece of technology rather than a work of art, although there are some very interesting artistic pieces in it. Um, and the interplay of the light on the various shapes is um, very gratifying. <laughs> 